hieleras, their ice boxes. Yelera. The Yelera, which means refrigerator or ice box. This is what the children know is the place where they're put when they first are come into contact with immigration But um, actually, officials. it's not the children. It's Border Patrol themselves. Border Patrol calls it that. Okay. So when they're saying to you, we're bringing you into detention, it is a phrase they have coined. Wow. It is a, a reality they have designed, and they threaten people with these ice boxes. They then put them into them. Their lips turn blue. They become chapped. Their fingers turn blue. They take out their outer, outer garments. They're given no sanitary napkins, no personal items. 20 women and children are placed in one place for days at a time. The lights are kept on. They don't know whether it's night or day. There's one toilet in the corner that's public to everybody and four sanitary napkins that are given for 20 women at one time. People are stained in blood. People are stained in urine. And they're given sandwiches two times a day that they have to grab in order to get. And one thermos that's placed there with water that smells like bleach and burns their throat. And this is happening today. This is happening every day to thousands and thousands of people. And there's a billion dollar private industry that's benefiting from this. The GeoCorp and the Corrections Corporation of America, which are incarceration companies, are making millions of dollars over these detention facilities at our southern border, which are housing children.